Hey there, in this video let's look closer at the fractalize feature in Absynth. We will examine this with both the transform menu in the wave window as well as the fractalize oscillator module. Looking at the transform menu, by default the wave becomes fractalized with smaller wave repetitions called iterations. There is also a displacement warping applied. The iterations are essentially whole octaves by which the current wave is multiplied. With displacement, each iteration becomes skewed to introduce sidebands. If I set the displacement to neutral at 50, the wave repetitions are symmetrical and harmonized and no sideband harmonics are generated. The wave organ 1 is an example of a fractalized wave, with 6 iterations, or 7 total harmonics including the fundamental. The spectrum displays each of the octave iterations, 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, and 64. Choosing to fractalize this wave and then removing harmonics shows that there are still two remaining in the wavetable. If on the other hand we choose to fractalize harmonically dense waveforms like the real waves, the effect may not be as distinct. Given that the harmonic content of a digital saw wave already covers 9 octaves, this is related to the iterations consuming the same spectrum initially. Any increase in brightness of the wave is usually compensated in the headroom by the dampening in low frequency harmonics. However, great shapes can be useful in modulation as LFO sources. With narrow displacement, we can create resonant sounds and rough yet organic bass tones. In the oscillator fractalize module, we can add an extra 6 iterations to the wave and modulate the other parameters in real time. While the upper and lower limits of the oscillator displacement is a little weaker than the transform menu, it can be freely modulated and scaled across keys. Increasing the amount knob relates to increasing the overall brightness. Additionally, the iterations can be spaced apart up to two octaves. Notice how the octaves overlap each other. For better CPU buffering and sound quality, Fractalize is best used for simpler waves with less harmonics. This is especially true with the oscillator module, where aliasing may occur due to transposing the sound across extremely wide spectrums. Here we are covering 8 octaves with aliasing. Removing one or more voices prevents this.
given the negative transposition, in this case we also have a growling type of sub-oscillator. The random parameter applies to the original voice only. Enveloping between high and low displacement means that the wave can oscillate between harmonised and rougher tones. Overall, Fractalize is great for generating rich tones, distinct from FM and distortion type synthesis. It's easy to create bright and harmonized tones and add further movement with modulation.